honored to be here today to stand with the California Community Colleges in support of Undocumented Student Action Week. There are an estimated 50,000 to 70,000 undocumented students currently enrolled in the California Community College system. Of these students, fewer than 20,000 receive any state-based financial aid, none receive any federal aid, and yet every day they persist in pursuing their education and their training goals. COVID-19 has exacerbated many of the hardships these students face. So during this Undocumented Student Action Week, I hope you'll join me in support of undocumented students and advocating for a pathway to citizenship for all DACA recipients. Thank you. Fighting for our dreamers is deeply personal to me. You see, both my parents came to this country without papers, chasing the California dream. And they showed me that growing up in East Los Angeles, there was no limit to what our immigrant community can accomplish. I am proud to have always fought for our dreamers, from working as a staffer for Assemblymember Marco Fireball on AB 540 almost 20 years ago, guaranteeing in-state tuition to all students, to now authoring my own AB 540 expansion bills to make sure that community colleges and non-traditional students are covered. To our dreamers, your courage is inspiring and motivates me to keep fighting. You are making history and taking your rightful place in our great American story. On this Undocumented Student Action Week and every day, I pledge to always stand with you to urge Congress to create an affordable and realistic pathway to citizenship. La lucha sigue, continuamos adelante, siempre juntos, and please stay safe. The Foundation for California Community Colleges is proud to partner with our colleagues at the Chancellor's Office, Immigrants Rising, the Community College League of California, and the Student Senate for California Community Colleges in what is always a powerful and inspiring week of action to support the undocumented students we serve across our system. Given the rhetoric at the national level surrounding immigration, we know now more than ever how critical it is that our campuses remain accessible and open to all students equally, regardless of their immigration status. Together, we must continue to uphold California's values and offer clear pathways and resources for undocumented students to attain their educational goals so they feel supported and able to build the brighter future that they have dreamed of for themselves and for their families. We stand in solidarity with our undocumented students and are grateful to all of you for your advocacy, your dedication, and your commitment to making the California Community Colleges more diverse, equitable, and inclusive. Undocumented Student Action Week reflects and it advances the core values and the essential mission of our members, all 116 California Community Colleges. The League strongly supports Undocumented Student Action Week because it's highly consistent with our belief in equity, educational opportunity, and open access higher education for all Californians. I know the power of immigrants, not only in the founding story of our country, but in the building of an incredibly strong and powerful economy here in California. As the daughter of immigrants, as the first in my family to go to college and graduate, I also know how critical it is that we ensure college opportunity exists for all Californians. It is not only the right thing to do, it is what makes California the powerhouse that it is. It will help us out of this global health pandemic. It will ensure our economic recovery. We cannot afford to leave anybody behind. We stand together in support of everyone that loves and calls California home. Thank you. Undocumented students are Californians and are a significant part of the social and economic fabric of our state. At CSAC, we are doing everything we can to get the word out that the California Dream Act application is the vehicle for undocumented students to get state financial aid for college. And yes, financial aid is still available even if your classes have gone online and regardless of your immigration status. So be sure to submit your California Dream Act application to get state financial aid. Visit csac.ca.gov to learn more about this opportunity. As we enter Undocumented Student Week of Action, I would like to take this opportunity to reaffirm that our system, the nation's largest system of higher education, is committed 
and remains committed to providing a welcoming and accessible place for all students, regardless of immigration status. During these times of great need and uncertainty, we are committed to providing all students the support they need to stay enrolled, continue their education, and achieve their goals. We are recognizing that our undocumented students are among the brightest and the hardest workers, many of whom are working on the front lines during the current pandemic to provide for their families. And we know that they have a critical role in their recovery after this pandemic. Please join our system during the week of action and going forward in supporting our undocumented students, collaborate and find ways to help ease the myriad of challenges they are facing, share resources with one another and advocate on behalf of our students. We must together press for an immediate and permanent resolution for these wonderful students. Thank you and please vote in this November election.